How's it going guys and welcome to a very special Have You Seen It Today. Yes, I have set this massive set up in this room tonight and it has taken me an hour and a half. This is an open room so there's so much noise. Today we're looking at two films. Two films, yes it's a special Have You Seen It Today. A good trailer for an average movie and a bad trailer for a really good movie. So I'm excited. Yeah. Firstly, this one was requested by Honest R. Thank you very much for your suggestion. This is why I love your suggestions in the comments. It's fantastic. So let's take a look. Sorry about the low quality of this one. This is the only trailer I could find that is this trailer in the quality it is. So bear with me. Sorry about it. The standard repository for all knowledge and wisdom in the universe is called The Hitchhiker's Guide to the Galaxy. And it has this to say about movie trailers. Movie trailers are designed to give you an idea of the film in question in a very short space of time. Often this section is preceded by the words, in a world. But sometimes not. <laughs> this is the best movie trailer I've ever seen. This is going to make my top 10 favorite movie trailers I do one day. This is so good. Oh my gosh. Occasionally interrupted by a girl in a bikini. That does absolutely nothing for me. <laughs> and lastly, there is a final montage, often set to rock music. Let's do it! Come on! To be designed simply to blow away whatever synapses you have left in your brain. This culminates in a reveal of the main title, like so. The Hitchhiker's Guide to the Galaxy. Followed by the release date, so that the audience might plan the next few months of their lives accordingly. Oh yeah, thanks for adding that in the footprint there. I, don't, I didn't know that that's what's in a trailer. It's just the perfect trailer, poking fun at other trailers and pretty much pointing out all the awful cliches whilst selling a movie to the fans of the original book. That's the comedy of this movie. That's how it works. The movie was okay to watch. I recommend you. I wouldn't exactly recommend it, but it's really wacky and it's really, it tries things that other films have just not even touched and are just like, oh, audiences weren't like that. That's why it's it's not bad to watch. I haven't seen it in a few years, so I'm probably not the right person to tell you. But I like this film sort of. Yeah. I what? It's just such a unique trailer because there's no other trailer like that, obviously. I haven't seen one like that that points out all the cliches. Tell me if there is, put it in the description. What? I control the disc disc what the fuck? Put it in the comments if you know another trailer that's like that. That was just the next one is a letdown. It's a bad trailer for one of my favorite films, one of my all-time favorite movies, Raiders of the Lost Ark. This is really bad. This was requested by one of my favorite YouTubers, Swabble Socks. Go check out his channel, please, and subscribe to it. <laughs> He's probably hating this promotion to his channel, but I have to do it. It's so good. It deserves more subs. Him and Honest R added the link in the comments. I think both of their comments got flagged for review, and I can't approve their comments, which is shit. Still comment, even if it does get flagged for review, I'll still see. It. Just letting you know, adding the link is just a great idea, so yeah. Legends for doing this, thank you so much guys. On to the second trailer. So Swabble pointed out that there's 40 seconds of titles and uh, now I'm starting to see how painful it is. No one knows its secrets. Jones, do you realize what the Ark is? It's a transmitter. It's a radio for speaking to God. This isn't how Indiana Jones rock goes. An army which carries the Ark before it is invincible. But the movie isn't even about the Ark. That's just a sub thing that they're looking for. It's more about the adventure. Fucking hell. You guys can see that, right? How can you fucking see it? The trail is so freaking dark. At least we got the freaking Indiana Jones music. And the boulder. Alright, we'll get, we'll get it. Okay, we'll give it the ending. The ending was alright. 
But the rest was a piece of shit. That was one of the worst trailers I've ever seen in my entire life. Is it going to autoplay? No, it's not. Not this time. The person who made this trailer did not watch the movie. They didn't even give a fuck. They're just like, oh, look at this clip. This clip's cool. Let's put this in. Let's... Oh, yep, yeah, he says that. That must lead to a plot device. Sort of. No, well, it doesn't really. Who the fuck cares? This is not showing what Indiana Jones really is. This is just showing a shitty action movie in the trailer. Like, it's pointing out plot devices but it's doing it in a fucking awful way. Thanks for the people that suggested those trailers. Please suggest trailers. I will take your suggestions. It's not like I'm saying suggest trailers and then I'm not playing them and then I'm not using them for the show. I set this up just for those two people who suggested it. So next time I'll do my trailer reaction on the roof if you suggest more. And then I'll do it on top of a moving bus. I don't know if we'll go that far. Probably not. That's a bit too far. Thanks for watching guys, this was an absolute nightmare to make. I started two hours ago, I'm not joking, I started setting this up two hours ago. I need a rest, I'm fucking done with this day. Thanks for checking this one out, I'll be back with my Lost Media special of course, I'm excited. It's a good time for this YouTube channel, you know, it's not getting many subscribers as it was in December. Why do I fucking care? I just do it for the love of Make It Done. I just spent two hours doing this. I hate this. This is the worst fucking thing ever. I hate Just kidding. This is awesome. I fucking I put a lot of effort in. So fuck. Thanks, guys. Yeah. Crack that whip, Indiana Jones. The f this is... Crack that whip. Licorice whip. I said whip it. <laughs>